George is in red tops. They are in the silver bottoms, red helmets, and trimmed in white. Tennessee all in white, like a home team. White tops, white bottoms, white pants, white helmets, orange numbers. Willie Galt, the sprinter, is a deep man. And that young freshman out of Stone Mountain, Kevin Butler, going to kick off for the first time in his whole life. It seems so strange not to see the tracks over there. And they tell me there might be a couple of parties on the track staring at the back of all that concrete and listening. Tennessee three and the clock running, and I wonder if Erskine Russell is somewhere walking barefooted in the sand and swinging at the gnats and having a six-pack. I two men spread. Dogs in the 33. Herschel in the middle. They grab at him. He twists to the 30 to the 29 and a half. A little hole at left guard. Tennessee came in on him. Leonard Jackson, the middle guard, would not let go all the time. Herschel penetrated from the 33 to the 29 and a half. He got three and a half. We'll give him four. Second down, about six and a half. Lauren? I can tell you where Eric Russell is. He's sitting by his radio, and I know he's sweating as much as anybody is here because he still feels a part of this team, although he's gone on to a different situation. And there's old players. Seven and up in dogs lead. I slant to the right. Butler's kick, a flat sailing ball, going to hit on the ground on the four. Willie Gall bounces to catch a high bounce behind the goal line. He's at the 10 of the 15. And one man got him on the 15 or 16. Roy, was that that freshman kid out of Knoxville? Roy, who's on the kick covering team, a young freshman out of Knoxville, Tennessee. Roy got him on the 16. I'll tell you one thing, that made his day. Ten seconds, station identification, Georgia football net. Cloud stands up to roar at the kick covering team. Willie Galt deep for Tennessee, couple of yards, almost three in the end zone. Young Butler going to kick high and short around the five or six to Galt near the sideline trying to come back up the middle and they knock him down on the 16 or 17 he caught it on the five or six the same young Knoxville freshman Roy was the first guy I think that hit him Roy was the first guy that hit him and then two red jerseys can you imagine what that Knoxville kid feels like, Phil, making tackles on kickoffs? Well, he's got to be very high right now, and of course the crowd is high. I don't know about the Georgia football team.